You're listening to Piccadilly on 103 FM. But on this frequency from September the 3rd, there'll be a totally new station. Key 103 will have less emphasis on chart music, but play classic hits, not forgetting the best contemporary sounds. Key 103 will tell you the news and travel information you need to know without going overboard on the details. But if you prefer, you'll hear Piccadilly 24 hours a day on 11.52 a.m. From September the 3rd, the choice is yours. Piccadilly on 11.52 AM or Key 103 here on FM Stereo. FM only, FM 103, Key 103 is what it's called. And it starts on Saturday the 3rd of September. And that's when I should do my first show for Key. Uh, it is what I would call laid back. No hurry, just romantic. It has been uh, labelled other things around the station, but I'd like to say it's laid back and we're in no hurry, just nice and easy. Key 103, FM 103, on your stereo. Uh, that's on Saturday, the 3rd of September, at 10 o'clock. Please join me at Don Cougar. We're all different. I love to hear a bit of chat and gossip in the morning and to hear the new number one. We're all different. When I wake up, I want to hear great music, but not too loud, as well as the headlines and basic travel information. And because we're all different, there'll be a choice of listening from September the 3rd. If you like classic tracks from... Starship. Paul Simon. Genesis. Dire Straits. Aretha Franklin. James Taylor. Steve Winwood. Please. Then you'll love Key 103, opening on September the 3rd here on 103 FM. The music experience. Suspense McDonald. Oh, no. Upset today, morning, yes. I've heard Spence McDonald's dead, yes. Oh, he's dead. I hear he's dead, 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 dead. Oh, I think he's dead, wicked. Yes, he's wicked. I, oh, have you heard his show? I know, oh, I don't know, I can listen to it. It's wicked, wicked, wicked. He goes on and on and on. What's he giving away? Muck, he's giving away muck. Books, I don't want top books, no. I don't want for books. I can't read for one thing. I keep losing my glasses. I keep forgetting where I put them. I flushed them down the toilet the other week without, oh, oh my head, it's all topsy turvy these days. Oh, what did I do? Oh, you never guess what I did. <laughs> I started over in the patio. Well, not the patio, I like to call it the patio. It's a front doorstep, but uh, I like to think it's a patio, you know. What I'm going to do before you know, before I pop it, I decided today, before I pop my clogs, I'm going to spend all my money, yes, 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 I'm going to spend it on all these luxuries, like um, soup with croutons, yes, and also, I might get myself a new nightdress, I've had mine since the war, there's all holes in it, yes, it's no good, no, well, no, I'll get a separate bed as well, I want a separate bed for that big fat bird, he's horrible, he smells, hmm, well, it's either him or the cat litter, I don't know which one it is, but both of them smell equally as bad as each other, hmm, oh, it's a shame, oh, that cat smells, I told him to bury it when it died two years ago, but no, he have it in the front room, patting it. Oh, it's, oh, it's all... Oh, don't want to talk about it. No, oh, it's, it's horrible, yes. Oh, well, anyway. Oh, you never guess what happened to me today. Oh, yeah, I nearly died, yes. Well, literally died, yes. Pop me clocks, yes. Well, what is it? I thought my oven wasn't working, you know. So I popped my head in to have a look. Well, anyway, I came over all queer, yes. Oh, it came all queer, and yes. I nearly died, but uh, fortunately, my husband was on hand, yes. That, the, the smell sort of brought me round, yes. Anyway, it doesn't matter about that, because I must wait, Spencer, all the best, whatever he's doing. Uh, and because it's all changing things, aren't they? And just got used to this. Apparently, apparently, he, he said whatever he's doing in the future, he can't fit me in. So it would, it would seem that this is my last sort of thing with you, as you know it. I'm sure I'll pop back, you know, occasionally to do things, but he tells me it's my last one. So for this, I'm going to take my teeth out. I don't usually do it, but I'm going to take them out so you can sort of just see what I look like without my teeth. So just hang on. Let me get my glass here. Uh, let me take them out. Oh, oh. Right. Oh, that's better. Oh, yes. I can't let the sweet pop through that, my teeth. But uh, I'll just put them back in there again. I can't speak at all. I can't do the blue one, I'll say. <laughs> oh, that's better. Oh, yes, well, I can't do without my teeth. I had them removed about, oh, well, how old was I? Fifteen. We used to, oh, we used to brush them. Haven't heard this toothpaste nonsense then? No, we used to brush it with salt and soot. Yes, and it did him good. Uh, said they had to have them removed when they were 15, but that's beside the point. Well, I must wish all the best, Spencer. And uh, let me say, whatever's coming up next week, it can't be as bad as this muck we're having to listen to. Eee! Thank you anyway. Bye-bye, total pig. 
93 FM. But on this frequency from September the 3rd, there'll be a totally new station. Key 103 will have less emphasis on chart music, but play classic hits, not forgetting the best contemporary sounds. Key 103 will tell you the news and travel information you need to know without going overboard on the details. But if you prefer, you'll hear Piccadilly 24 hours a day on 11.52 a.m. From September the 3rd, the choice is yours. Piccadilly on 11.52 a.m. or Key 103 here on FM Stereo. You're part of the experience. Yeah. The Piccadilly experience. Piccadilly Radio.